This room is, is my place. I mean, I, I've always loved being surrounded by magic. And each one of these pieces has a story. The, one of the main reasons I started collecting magic for is because I've always been one to go counter to the trends. I see the trends in magic, I want to go the other way. And one thing that I realized was uh, when a new magic effect comes out, every magician is lining up to buy these things and they're all doing them. I have stuff that not every magician will have. They're gone. Once they're gone, they're gone. All these, most of these here are in the hands of collectors because most of them are limited edition items. That guarantees that you're only going to have 50 other people on the planet, 100 people that will have this effect. The only way any other magician can get this effect is buying it off the used market. Now magic in general, yes, nowadays you've got the internet. Anybody can buy magic tricks, but to be a magician is, um, you've got to put the hours in to get the basics of sleight of hand down. Uh, a lot of young guys uh, go out and spend thousands of dollars on huge illusions and they call themselves a magician, but they don't understand that it's, uh, it's the presentation and the understanding, the, the history behind the effect. I mean, magicians that, that actually stand in here, they go, wow, wow, and they just want to sit for a while.